Mr. Humble Hippie here in the state of Jefferson, Forest Route number six, Forest Road, land of danger. And even though the roads got a lot better just now, this red dirt and rock is a lot better than these big sharp boulders that I've been driving over. Of course, you shouldn't be out here with your slapper for you old folks. That means a low riding vehicle or a car and uh, many, many, many days of survival foods, which I have all of the above. Well, I have a four-wheel drive anyway. Oh, no. And I have a lot, a lot of weight in the vehicle. So. problem with out here is you'll one you'll bottom out and two your tires will pop all right anyway don't do like I do just watch my videos because uh, these roads can be the last your last drive you get stuck out here no one will ever find you it's too far to walk There's lots of animals. Probably not a lot of water. At least for somebody that doesn't know how to find it. So, uh, oh, I don't want to bottom out. Don't want to pop my tires. Oh yeah, the moral of this is like all of my things. Uh, do not go off road. Drive all the way back to the freeway. Don't take the shortcut because I'm taking the road, the roads that show that show uh, passage, and uh, on the uh, map, you know, it shows a totally a paved route called Stevens Pass, which uh, does not exist. And I'm telling you, if you try and take Stevens Pass, or at least this version of it, your life is in danger. So. Uh, be that as it may, enjoy your day. It's beautiful in the state of Jefferson. I got plenty of food. Not as much water as I would prefer. Yep, because Mr. Big Mouth there, me included, drink it all up. Try and always have four gallons minimum in the car at all times. And that's just your everyday. So what I have done is dropped off a few gallons everywhere that I've been just lately. So, uh, I mean, at, at different camps, at different people's properties that I go to. So if there's a water shortage for any reason or just for my own supplies, I have water stored up there along with gasoline, which I could probably use. Um, just for the record, that's not a lot of gas when you're out on this type of road in the middle of nowhere in the wilderness and um, yeah I'm really feeling better than worse I mean it could be it could be dark out and um, I could not be sure if I was on this or that road and at least I've got a lot of signs believe it or not they keep showing on this road saying that I'm on route or road or forest road six which is not to be confused with the freeway or a highway or a real road and um yeah there's some big rocks out here huh boom oh and you haven't noticed the mountain to the right of me is totally clear cut because uh, it seems to be the fun thing to do out here is bow down the mountains and uh shoot things so uh I don't know. I'm just trying to find some land to buy. And uh, again, you people following your Tom Toms and or I've got dual maps, okay? Topographical maps I paid good money for. Delorn, don't trust them. And uh, you know, 
like I said, I'm in the middle of the wilderness right now on a on a road that says it's a pass through these wilderness mountains. And uh, if you can't figure out how dangerous this is right now, <laughs> you're crazy as I am. Come on out, have a good time with the me. We'll go camping, and we'll go hiking, and we'll go explore the great unknown because there's a lot of it out here. And uh, I can't tell you how happy I am to have brand new tires right now and to know that my brakes are okay and um, that I got my dog with me and I got all you people listening to my videos and um, seems like a great place to just come hang out but uh, as far as a safe drive through the woods eh. 